Thank you for watching our video. Please give us a big like, subscribe to our channel for new videos every day with amazing cars. Leave us your opinion in the comment section on the video. Thank you, automotive journalists can be spoiled. Give us 600 horsepower, and we'll invariably think that another 100 horsepower or so wouldn't hurt. This crowd is hard to please. But every once in a while, there's a car that leaves us wanting nothing more. Today, we have driven one of those the BMW M3 CS. It's the latest and ultimate expression of the current generation M3, the culmination of what this nameplate represents. The M3 CS marks a significant step up from the base M3 and even from the competition model. The horsepower increase over the M3 competition is modest, from 444 horsepower to 453, the regular M3 makes 425, but the torque boost is strong, the S55 twin turbocharged 3.0-liter and line 6, in this iteration, peaks at 443 pounds to foot, versus 406 for the base and competition models. The result, Munich claims, is 0 to 60 miles per hour in 3.7 seconds and a top speed governed at 174 miles per hour in our test of the competition model. It got to 60 miles per hour in 4.0 seconds flat and was governed to 163 miles per hour. The ease with which the M3 CS attains triple digit speeds is incredible. There is an excess of power on tape at all times, delivered with the mischievous eagerness. We didn't detect the slightest turbo lag, and this straight six relentlessly revs up to 7,600 revolutions per minute. The exhaust is louder than on the regular M3, it varies with the selected driving mode by electrically operated flaps in the exhaust system, and when you take your foot off the gas, there is a perfectly engineered crackle. Sport Plus is our favorite setting for the powertrain, and we prefer the fastest setting for the gear shifts of the 7-speed dual-clutch automatic. Because, alas, there is no manual transmission option on this Ultimate M3. To be sure. The dual clutch gearbox does everything right. The shifts are quick and refined, and if you prefer to use the console shifter instead of the paddles on the steering wheel, it is configured properly, pull back to upshift, push forward to downshift, just like in a racing car. This is exactly as you want it, given the severity of the M3's acceleration and braking forces. The chassis works in perfect unison with the engine. Compared with the Bass M3, the entire window of characteristics is pushed toward an even sharper, more competitive edge. Frank Van Meel's team has tinkered with the stability control system, the electrically assisted steering, the rear differential, and all the driving modes. We drove the M3 CS on Michel and Pilot Super Sport tires, size 265-35ZR19 up front and 285-30ZR20 in the rear, and with the optional, $8,150, carbon ceramic brakes. Less aggressive summer tires will be standard in the United States. The differences among the driving modes are significant. The comfort setting of the dampers leads to a relatively wallowy ride for such a focused driving machine, Sport is ideal for most occasions, and Sport Plus is so stiff that it works well only on very smooth surfaces. The same settings apply to the power steering. We find that an artificially heavy steering feel doesn't signify sportiness, and thus we prefer either the comfort or Sport settings but not Sport Plus which is heftier without adding any feel for the road surface. You can also fiddle with the stability control, while turning it off entirely is recommended only for expert track drivers. We found the intermediate setting to be a smart and happy compromise between hypervigilant intervention from the computers on the one hand and a reckless dismissal of electronic supervision on the other. But the M3CS leaves you the choice. Approaching the limits of adhesion in the sportier modes is a safe and fun affair, with plenty of feedback from the chassis. Even if you happen to be stuck in traffic, the M3 CS offers something more than the standard model, its cabin is adorned with specific microfiber suede decor. The strips on the passenger side of the dash and on the steering wheel are pure awesomeness. And the light grey and black leather on the seats is specific to the M3 CS.
The exterior is distinctive as well, thanks to dark grey wheels designed to resemble those on DTM racing cars, which are scanned to resemble M4 coupes, and a pronounced gurney flap on the deck lid. Like the hood and roof, the spoiler is made of carbon fibre. BMW says the CS is 110 pounds lighter overall than the standard M3, not accounting for the couple dozen pounds of mass reduction that comes with the carbon ceramic brake package. It was all but impossible to find fault with the M3 CS, the first four-door sedan to wear BMW's storied CS badge. Sure-footed and civilized yet aggressively playful, it will be priced at $99,245. Hurry if you want one, almost all 1,200 units are already spoken for. Thank you for watching our video, please give us a big like, subscribe to our channel for new videos every day with amazing cars. Leave us your opinion in the comment section on the video. Thank you.